Imagine a room filled with children. They get a box and they have no idea what's in this box, what they're about to receive. And the countdown happens and the cheers just erupt everywhere. My university started doing packing parties right before National Collection Week. And so that's when I really got involved with it. So the journey of a shoebox starts in sending countries like the United States with local groups or individuals packing shoeboxes and then donating them during National Collection Week in November. From there, they go to a processing center. It's an amazing experience to be in the processing center working towards the same goal of reaching kids with the gospel. From there, they'll be sent all around the world. This could be the first present that they've ever received. It could be something that they, their family specifically needs in that moment. A shoebox is so much more than just a shoebox. A shoebox is such an incredible opportunity for a child to get to know Jesus, and then not just that, but for that family to also get to know Jesus. After that, the children are invited back to the Greatest Journey Discipleship Program. These children have the opportunity to go through classes to learn about the gospel. In Matthew 28, 18, Jesus said, go and make disciples of all nations. Right now, as a college student, I can't really go around the world and share the gospel, but I can share the gospel with people by packing shoeboxes. By packing my shoebox, I could reach a child somewhere in Southeast Asia. It can be a way to just show them that someone cares, just knowing that someone out there loves them and just knowing that like God loves them in this tangible way. I feel like I'm just a student. I can make an impact. I thought that this was a way to serve others. As a student, you can make an impact missionally. To be part of something global, the global mission, without even having to go overseas. To give back to so many, that's something I want to do and continue doing with my life. You can make a difference by back in the shoebox. Jesus himself said, let the little children come. They hear the good news. They can't contain it. Kids can't contain something that's exciting to them. They spread it out. I would say they're the greatest evangelists.